Hello everyone, and welcome to another Orca Security News episode. In this episode, we will discuss a newly discovered vulnerability in the Linux container space. But before we begin, let's explain, in short, what containers are and how they relate to Kubernetes. A container is a set of one or more processes isolated from the rest of the system. And Kubernetes is an open source container orchestration platform that automates many of the manual processes involved in deploying, managing, and scaling containerized applications. On January 18th, 2022, researchers found a heap-based buffer overflow flaw in the Linux kernel, which allows an out-of-bound write in kernel memory. Using this flaw, an attacker can escalate its privileges to root thus leading to privilege escalation, container environment escape, or denial of service. Namespaces are fundamental aspect of containers on Linux. This feature of the Linux kernel partitions kernel resources and allows one set of processes to see one set of resources, while another group of processes sees a different set of resources, potentially in multiple spaces. If an attacker can exploit remotely accessible services and establish a foothold on a compromised container, they can leverage this flaw to escape a container environment and gain root privileges on the host system. The exploit requires the compromised container to have the CAPSYS admin capability, which can be found, for example, in privileged containers. By default in Kubernetes, an attacker can achieve this capability in any user namespace, including in unprivileged containers, by calling the unshare functionality of the compromised container. This vulnerability affects Linux kernel versions 5.1 to 5.16.1. While no specific exploit have been released publicly at this time, researchers can demonstrate the vulnerability reliably. It is only a matter of time before publicly available exploits are released. You should follow your cloud provider's instruction, including abrogating images and OSs. In addition, you should narrow down the number of privileged containers in your clusters, and it is also recommended to disable Linux unprivileged user namespaces. Using Orca Sonar language, you can easily map and detect vulnerable workloads and nodes to mitigate and remediate this vulnerability. Orca Security's agentless platform provides 100% visibility into your cloud assets on AWS, Azure, and Google Cloud. It will generate an alert for each asset exposed to this vulnerability. In addition, Orca will prioritize detected vulnerabilities based on possible business impacts of potential exploitation. This allows security teams to first focus on remediating the vulnerabilities that, if exploited, would have the most significant adverse effect on your organization. We currently offer a free risk assessment of your cloud, which will assist you in discovering such vulnerabilities. After running the risk assessment, we will provide your organization with a detailed report, an executive summary, and time with our cloud security expert if needed. Try it now!